Hey, are you okay? Hey, you, yeah, yeah, I'm good. I'm good. Um, I just, I just forgot my key, and oh, uh, I have my passport inside. I have to oh. go somewhere, and um, yeah, yeah, for some reason, uh, I can't, I can't get inside. But I tried reaching out to my friend already. He said, yeah. he's, he said he's coming. Okay, so today I decided that, uh, okay, I want to go to um, the States to go see Mel and see how she's doing. Um, I mean, we've been talking on the phone and um, she's fine, but like, you know, I just want to just show up and go see how she's doing. I mean, it's two hours drive, so let's do it. No, um, I'm actually staying with a friend down there. Oh. Um, oh. I'm not from Toronto. Uh, oh, so. oh, oh, okay. Yeah. Um, so, uh, yeah. Um, <laughs> but, uh, okay, well, let me know. We're just down there. Um, let me know if you need anything or you're. All right, all right. Oh, no, no worries, no worries. But thank you so much. No, uh, of course. I'm just going to check on this guy and, like, because he said he's going to come downstairs and um, I'll probably go downstairs and grab the key for me and so I can quickly grab whatever I want to grab and Yeah, okay. Um, but uh, thank you so much. No, I, of course. I really, really appreciate it. Yeah, um, it was really suffer, nice to meet you. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, it's yeah, nice yeah. to meet you again. Yeah, um, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Um, yeah we'll, we'll see you around and good luck. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> um, thank you. Thank okay, you so no worries. Much. See you later. Uh, Hi, my name is Sophie. Um, I am a writer um, and right now I'm actually living with my friend Simon. Thank you, Simon, um, because we're working on a project uh, together. And he was like outside of his apartment and then I went outside, blah, 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 a few hours, came back and he was still outside of his apartment. Um, so. <laughs> really? <laughs> yeah, I was like, like are you okay? Like just in the hallway? Yeah. <laughs> what? What was he doing? He had gotten locked out. Oh. Today was a long day. Like, longest day. Um, <laughs> from uh, me forgetting my key, I couldn't get in. So now I had to wait. So, while waiting, so I saw, I saw this girl. Um, Demi is so hot. Um, <laughs> I... I've seen him a few times in the hallway um, and it's one of those things where we like make awkward eye contact and we're like, but there was never really a reason to talk to each other. Um, but yesterday I saw him locked out of his apartment. Um, so I was like, this is the perfect opportunity to go and talk to him. Um, and he was really nice. I don't know if he's, I've never seen a girl come in the apartment um so i don't know um but he followed me on instagram uh and we were chatting a bit i just well i just met her today so but you don't keep my phone with messages blew my phone with messages man i mean i didn't even have the time to like really respond to her today but like you know tomorrow I'll probably or maybe later when i'm about to go to bed i'm just gonna respond to our messages but like if I can't give her a number and call she will call me that oh yeah I'm not stalking him yeah because I literally when I exited my apartment I saw you standing here and then I came uh, no, <laughs> and then you're know, still I here know, I know. but I told him that I was stalking him as a joke um, but I feel like he might think I was serious uh, so Debbie if you're watching this I'm not stalking you um, I did stalk his social media though, and I sent photos to my sister. <laughs> I wanted to go see Mel because, like, I know it's been a while, like, since the last um, thing that happened in the car, you know, because she just she went off and then she got out of the car. You know? And since then, I haven't. We've been talking on the phone, you know, but I haven't seen her since then. So I decided to like go go see her and surprise her. I mean, it's two hours drive, so let's do it.
I'm actually really glad he came because, like, you know, lately my schedule has been, like, really tight, so um, I just couldn't find the time to go and see him. But I'm glad that he's now the one that's coming to see me because after all the times that I went to go and see him, so, um, yeah, I'm glad he came. How you doing? How you doing? Um, <laughs> How um, are you? <laughs> I'm great. I'm great. Um, I'm happy I get to meet you yesterday and get to see you. Yeah, and, I'm um, actually shocked that you're here. You're shocked? Yeah, it took you some time to get here, but I mean, <laughs> um, you know, all the time you're always coming to Toronto, so I I think it's time for me to like you know come see you and um, yeah, I know, I'm glad you know. <laughs> <laughs> and I, I know um, from the last time the last time we'll it's not that I need someone I, uh, I said he saw that I was at the mall and he wanted to accompany me am I gonna say no like we know each other through social media he's a, he's a nice person I said yes take it how you want dummy I'm telling you exactly how it is like you're so f sensitive huh. like I'm actually done like what the freak you know, um, I'm sorry about I'm sorry about everything. You know, and I think the reason why I think it got to me was cause like the dude I know him. You know, we we work together at some points. You know, when we have gigs and all of that. So yeah, that's why I really really felt that. You know. Um, yeah, I'm glad he came. Um, so you know, of course, like first we talked about how we ended things because. It wasn't on a good note. Um, we were actually like raising our voices at each other and I didn't really like it. I ended up walking away. So it was <laughs> um, a bad character trait of mine. Like when things get too much, I just walk away because I don't want to deal with it. But She was happy that I was there, um, that I came, you know, and um, we spoke about everything that happened. I mean, we both need to apologize to each other, which we did. I understand that maybe how you felt, me with another guy. Mm -hmm. But I didn't know that he knew you. Oh. That, that you guys even know each other, you work together, whatever the relationship was. Yeah. Okay, so maybe that's what really hurt you, but I didn't know. And to me too, like, he's just a friend, you know? So I, I didn't think you know, you would take it the wrong way or anything. Yeah, it's all right, it's all right, it's all good, like, but yeah, yeah I'm, I'm just really, really sorry, for real, sorry, you yeah. know. Cause but, you, you actually raised your voice at me and I didn't like it. I, <laughs> and I raised my voice too, but it's because you yelled at me first you and know, I didn't I, like that. Yo, I was even trying to call you back when you were leaving it. Because you hurt my feelings. Mm. You actually hurt my feelings at me, like. But um, if we're going to leave the past in the past, then let's leave it in the past. We talked about it, and I thought we came to, uh, you know, a conclusion, you know, to just dead everything. Yeah, I mean, I understand. And that's why I was like, okay, you know what, I'm just, um, you know, take a day off and just come down here and then get to see you. And um, just, we, yeah, because I, I really had to do it, so... But yeah, so I feel like you accepted. <laughs> okay. <laughs> no, <laughs> for real, for real, for real. I feel accepted. Do you accept my apology? Cause, oh, wait, uh, I didn't even pull it. I'm sorry. Okay. okay. I'm also sorry that, right. you know, maybe I didn't use common sense, I guess. But yeah, I'm glad we can squash it. It's in the past and it won't happen again. Um, okay, okay, thank you. Let's we bring shake, it in. Let's, let's shake on it. Bring it in, bring it in. No! Bring it in. <laughs> no, let's so shake I, on it. So I'll be doing it, I'll be doing I'm it. I'm not, man, let's shake on it. Okay. Oh, wait, <laughs> so are we, are we signing a contract or yes, something? Yes, that it will not happen again. Okay. And you will not will, raise your voice at me again. Okay, that you two will not raise your voice at me again. Uh-uh. You uh, did it oops. first. I, I mean, yeah, so I said yes, I won't raise my voice at you again. Okay. And you two, yes. you won't okay. raise your voice at me again. <laughs> okay. okay. Bring it in. Okay. Uh, <laughs> Ooh. So, how was um how was it when you went back home? I actually saw the video that you yeah. made about your dad. It actually almost made me cry. It was so cute. Yo, trust me. Every time I go back to the video, like I I need to at least have a tissue with me, cause like yo, I'm tearing up. But it was it was good. It how was do you good. feel now? Like, do you miss your dad now? I mean, yeah, of course, like, you know, that's the first time I'm actually experiencing that father love physically, you know, and when I, when I was going there, I didn't tell nobody that was coming, right, yeah. 
So it was like and a, I would a real see my surprise. dad in like 15 years, you know. And um, so when I showed up, <laughs> yo, this man was crying. I know. <laughs> yo, yo, this man was shedding tears like. I was like, but it was, it was That's great. why you're emotional, so just like your dad. I, I guess so, I <laughs> guess so. But like, love your eyes. Thank you. You're so pretty. <laughs> Thank you. You're so pretty, you know. Thank you. You're welcome. You're really, really pretty. <laughs> wow. Okay. <laughs> I'm gonna get some water. Okay, yeah. Hey, gist. We kissed though. So we kissed. <laughs> um yes. Hey, hey. It's sweet. It's sweet. This time I had a no chop slap. She didn't slap me. It, I, I wanted the kiss. I didn't slap him this time. This time it was good. Um, so it was kind of like, you know, one of those movie scenes where it's like, it's like quiet for a while and you're just looking in each other's eyes. And so <laughs> um, he leaned in a little bit and then I leaned in also. And um, yeah, I just caressed his face a little bit and then kissed and it was nice. And then I got really hot. So I had to leave the scene, but <laughs> it was um, it was good. I enjoyed it. You were well. Ah. Yeah, you see it. You see it. Maybe we'll make the millions. We'll have ourselves some children. Oh, what a love could do. Maybe we'll live in Vegas or a house with picket fancy. Oh, what a love could do. Wow. Okay, <laughs> I'm gonna get some water. Okay, yeah. Ah. Ah. Oh my god. So <laughs> So after the kiss after the kiss the eat from me just passed through the lips you know the body is just uh, you know she just felt hot all of a sudden you know let me see that better kiss Kiss, you say you go kiss, you go lose everything, you go lose focus. So I can't kiss you every day. They give, you get. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah, yo, no, the kiss was good though. I'm never gonna lie. It was, it was good. Hey, yeah, Fia, what's up? Hey, how you doing, Dami? I'm good. I'm in your city. I'm in your city. <laughs> I know it's been a long time. It's been a long time. I know. How long? How long you staying for? <laughs> um, <laughs> to be honest, it's um. Wait, that's how you guys ask those questions, yeah? What do you how mean? long am I staying for? How long like, are you staying for? Is that not English? Yeah, it's English. You know, sometimes you guys have the uh, way you guys communicate here in Buffalo. You know. Um, it's I'm, actually I, English. Okay, 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 okay. Um, um, maybe like. A day, but I'm going back tomorrow. So, oh, okay. yeah. So. Oh, that's not bad, cause I know you be just popping out out of nowhere. I I know, I know, I know. No, so, it, like, it was cause I wasn't around though. It was cause I wasn't around. That was why. Yeah, cause I saw your Instagram and Africa and stuff. So how was that? Yo, Nigeria was fun. You know, it was it was it was the best vacation ever, cause I had to send my family too. Like, for you to know what kind of girl she is, you know from the friends that she roll with, you know. Because, like, I heard a set of friends, like, yo, they're cool. The people that she can always, because, like, she always tell me, like, anytime she's gone through stuff, she share with her friends and then they come through for her. So, you know, those are the kind of people you want in your life. So, like, I spoke to her best friend, like, she's really, really cool, nice. Yeah. I thought we came to, uh, you know, <laughs> a conclusion, you know, to just that everything. 
but I guess we know Dami as, <laughs> as the person that he is, you know, he just, he brought it back up again. Um, and, uh, <laughs> so, you know, there's always this question that's bothering me since um, that thing happened, you know, I was like, yo, who exactly is this guy's view? Like, I'm, I'm, I was just curious. You know, I just, I just want to hear from her. You know, I don't know if I was I wrong ask, asking that question. So I don't know. So yeah, I was just asking like, yo, was I wrong asking that question? But for real though, who is Malentino to you? Cause that day I came to pick you up, or like I don't know what he was saying to you. You were laughing out very loud. So I, I, I don't know. You're laughing out loud. I, I, so you're just gonna change the subject like that? I mean, I, I, I was just curious. So I just, I just wanna. Well, know. don't be curious. Cause I thought we just squashed it. Mm. So why are you I bringing it up? Just, just curiosity. Yeah. Mm. Curiosity. I don't. I really don't think you have the position to be asking me questions like that. <laughs> why not? Because it's like there's so many things that I could say about you that I don't bring up. Like. Like your job. Like well, all the girls day. that you're with every night, like you have a night job, uh, you have a weekend job. Like I'm only free on the weekends. You work on the weekends. Yeah. Like you're only here for a day because you have to go back. Mm. But I have all these things that I can say, but I, I don't say it. I mean, my job I've is. Because I've already accepted you, mm, right? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I've accepted you, and I understand. Okay. That that's your life, though. Okay, okay. My, my bad. Yeah. Uh, okay. No, I yes, it is the, your the, bad. The, 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 the most important thing is we just have to trust each other, you know? <laughs> yeah? We have to trust each other. It sounds like you don't trust me. Nah, I actually do. I was just curious, like I said. I was just mm. curious. So I was just curious. I just want to know. And then she was like, uh, you know, yo, you're just settling things here. Then you're trying to put in fire, you know? But no, I'm not trying to, you know, I just, you know, just curious. Like this, and I don't know. It was just giving me a headache. So <laughs> I just told him, you know, to calm him down. Just tell him, you know, next time I'll, I'll cook for him. And hopefully, hopefully, <laughs> he'll finally let it all go. Well, I do know that because, like, you know, with the kind of job that I do too, like, the more the girls, the more the ballers want to come through, you know. when. But let's see girls in the club, you know, stuff like that. That's what all those spenders want to see. But, yeah, but I told her that one thing that needs to be important, that is very, very important, is, you know, we just have to trust each other. So when we trust each other, I think everything is just going to fall through. So right now, how I feel about Dami, I still feel like Dami has a long way to go. <laughs> I still feel like he has a long way to go, um, but it, that's okay, you know? I, I feel like everyone is always learning in their journey or whatever, but um, you know, he's, he's still awkward, he's jealous, he's curious, you know, he's insecure <laughs> sometimes. But I think that's what makes Dami Dami, you know? Um, and I think I'm willing to, you know, still be, still give him chances to improve himself here and there. Um, yeah, and I know initially I said that I wasn't in the mind space for a relationship or anything, but maybe he's growing on me. I don't know. <laughs> we will see. But that trust, that trust is important, you know. Um, but when trust is there, trust me, everything is gonna work out well. I mean, um, you know, when Dami asked me about oh, like the Valentino thing. I could have like let him know that yeah like we still talk here and there like on Instagram and stuff like that but we are truly just friends you know like he replied to my story here replied to his story there like it's there's nothing behind it you know um, it's it's strictly strictly friends um, how I see things with Valentino like we're strictly friends like it, for me I don't know about him and I hope I've made it clear enough but. It's not gonna get there, you know. Um, we're just friends, and I enjoy his company. He's a funny guy, you know. So, yeah, I don't. It's it's not gonna get go anywhere, you know. That's all I have to say about that. But he's a great friend. <laughs>
I think it was a great thing that Dami was able to come here and finally, you know, be in my space. Um, and I hope, you know, in the future, like, we can continue to have better encounters and, you know, not have to argue and not bring up other people and just, you know, be able to focus on us. So the next time when I cook for him, hopefully we can just, you know, be in each other's space and have that time together where we're not thinking about everything else on the outside. Yeah, I hope, I hope we can get there because <laughs> I, have, I have faith, but we'll see. But overall, overall, though, the conversation was sweet, like everything we had to like, and then guess what? She has to come to my place. Well, not she has to, but she's planning to, which I think she will come to my place to cook. You know, so I'm excited. I'm excited. I can't wait for that day. So, and um, this is going to be the first time she's going to cook for me. So, like, you know, yeah, let's go to it. I'm ready. I'm ready. So which means if she's coming to cook for me, she's coming to Toronto by outside. But yeah, so she gets. <laughs>